Welcome back. Six men have filed a class action notice of claim against chemical company DuPont, saying they were treated unfairly and that the plant in Tonawanda was a hostile working environment. Two on your side's Natalie Foz spoke with these employees and their lawyers today about the complaint. Natalie? Mary Alice, the lawyer representing the men to said today that the claims of racism at DuPont are disturbing and they're seeking justice for their clients and all current past employees of the company. Six men are named in the class action complaint and four of them worked for the company for over 20 years. The men who are all black allege that they were not treated fairly when it comes to discipline, promotion and termination. They also said that DuPont managed, maintained a hostile and racist work environment. The suit alleges violations of New York State human rights law. Because of me and Ryan stepping up and talking about these issues, him being on the union board, me being a rep for 15 years, uh, we were targeted. And uh, we were targeted for our voices. And at some point, we were terminated. The men say that they were subjected to racially motivated attacks, such as a noose being hung on one of their toolboxes and repeated graffiti that included racial slurs. A spokesperson for DuPont said, quote, that they cannot comment on the allegations, adding, respect for people is a core value at DuPont. We cultivate diversity, equity, and inclusion in all aspects of our company and foster a workplace environment where all colleagues are valued and can thrive, end quote. On your side in the newsroom, Natalie Foss, Channel 2 News. Natalie,